Who's calling? Who's calling? Who's calling? It's just Jen on Light 98.7. Good morning, just Jen. Good morning. The Common Council has decided not to have fluoridation in the city water. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? It's a great thing. Of course, I'm a health advocate, so I think it's wonderful. A few people have some flustered feathers over it, but financially, it would be a lot to do that, as well as it's a chemical added in the water, and they kind of felt like with health concerns that everyone had the right to decide if they wanted that chemical in their water or not. I don't know a whole lot about this, but wouldn't the fluoride make it taste like toothpaste anyway? <laughs> wouldn't it be horrible? Your, your uh, water tastes like close-up or something? Uh, you know what it reminds me of? When I was in elementary school, we had to get these fluoride treatments. And I can still taste how awful it was. It had like this bitter aftertaste. It was kind of sweet at first. And then it would come and kick you right in the tail. I'm like, this is You're so nasty. So funny. Do you remember doing fluoride treatments? I don't recall that, but I do recall them giving us these tablets to chew to see where the plaque was on your teeth and you had red mouth. (laughs) Do they still do that? I'm curious. 721-0987. I do remember those. I really do. Oh, man, those were the days, weren't they? They were. Oh, you know what's the worst? Now that we're on these dental topics, when I went to the dentist, the last time I was there, they offered me bubblegum toothpaste. I'm like, am I five? Whatever happened to cinnamon and, like, peppermint and spearmint and like the traditional flavors i like my toms of maine thank you very much it's just jen on light 98.7 more of the most music morning show with matt hubble next